Hey guys, it's Justin and Alicia. And today we have seven new flavors of sparkling water that we have never tried before. And I'm so excited. We've got different brands. We've got LaCroix, Aha, uh -huh, Bubbly, and something called Liquid Death, which is Kinda, a little scary. I'm a little scared. <laughs> but all of these are just water and carbonation. Two of them, an AHA and a bubbly, have caffeine in them. And then this one does not have natural flavors, but the rest If you're are a parents like us, you like caffeine. Yes. So I'm excited. I'm especially excited about this bubbly. Yeah. It's it sounds really good. It's bubbly triple berry. Triple berry. Yeah. Not just single or double people. <laughs> So, we're talking triple berry here. So as always, we're going to rank them in order from love it to like it to it's all right all the way down to a pass. Let's just work our way across. Okay. We're going to start with LaCroix Limoncello. Limoncello. Limoncello? I don't know. It looks pretty good though. It looks this refreshing. One, it does look really good. Very yellow and happy. This is one that your sister, we got when we were with her because they have more flavors than us. And she That's actually helped us out with another one. Her Walmart. My sister it's lives in awesome. Mississippi. Shout out to the fam in Mississippi. They have sales at their Walmart. Like she buys our kids <laughs> shoes for like 50 cents. A dollar. A yeah. Dollar. I mean, it's, literally like it's a dollar ridiculous. For shoes. Okay. So... <laughs> Let me smell get a sniff it. of that. Oh, yeah. That it's, smells good. It smells almost like a lemon pie or something. Lemon pie. Lemon pie. What do you think? That's different. <laughs> That's very different. Let me try again. Is there coconut in there? It tastes like... Do you like taste the coconut? Coconut and vanilla. I taste vanilla. Coconut and vanilla and lemon. It tastes like a lemon That's pie. Pretty good. Not the sweetness of a pie, but just kind of that depth of flavor that yeah. a lemon pie would have. A lot have. of depth in that drink. That's a good Yeah. Point. That's good. Very good descriptive work. Thank you, thank you. Okay. All right. Now so, we got to rate it. I'm going to say I like it because I'm reserving my love it's for things that I would drink like reach for every time in the fridge. Yeah, I'm going to say it's all right for me. All right, AHA, you got to really step up your game because I am not impressed with you <laughs> at all. Like, you have been such a major letdown and ruined Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> the whole holiday season. AHA. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not that bad. Harsh. But, but, but uh, I've not been impressed. We've got a couple yet. AHA videos that you can, you can check that out. It's but. all right. Okay, how do you say this? Raspberry acai. <laughs> We've got raspberry acai. 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 Okay. Oh, people are screwing mm -hmm. with you. But. Let me Google to prove my point. We live in Texas, by the way, so we say stuff how we want to say it anyway. Acai. Yeah, that's Google, though. Google Is Google says, from Texas? Google says I'm right. Ooh, that smells good. You go first. Okay, the initial taste is good. Yes. It's the aftertaste, aha. Uh -huh. Ah, like, every that's the thing. time. You're every saying, initial taste for aha uh -huh sounds pretty good. Yeah. Tastes pretty good. The aftertaste of Jeez. this one tastes like medicine. Gosh, uh -huh. And as always, these are just our opinions. Um, we always have people in the comments who are offended that we like it or that we dislike it or whatever. But in our opinion, initial taste, good. Aftertaste, bad. <laughs> but for real, the aftertaste tastes like medicine. It does, but that initial taste was like solid. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it's like. Yeah. Mm -mm. I'm gonna go with that pass. I pass too. I, sorry. I, uh -huh. After you drink a whole can of that aftertaste, it's just mm -hmm. like. Uh, so, anyways. we have another aha. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. From Atlanta, <laughs> wait, Joe. Wait, wait, wait. How many do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six. We've got an extra one. I was going through our aha uh -huh boxes uh, from our last aha uh -huh video and I found some that we hadn't drank. This was one of them. So okay. we have tried this before in a previous video. All right, so if you want that one, go check it out in another aha uh -huh video. But we do have another aha. Uh -huh. Mango black tea. Uh, and it's got caffeine. Uh, this one, 
is turning me against it already. I'm nervous about it because even bubbly, and I like so many of the bubblies, yeah. even bubbly mango is not not good to me. I'm not a mango person anyway. It's just not a good flavor for me. It smells good. The tea in it smells good. It doesn't even smell good to me. I think they may have actually done it. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. That does not taste like an aha. Uh -huh. It doesn't. That tastes good. It doesn't have an aftertaste. <laughs> There's no aftertaste. I this, wonder if it's the tea wow. or the caffeine or, I don't know. But that's yeah, pretty good. This is actually good. Way I'm, to go, aha. Uh -huh. I can go with like it on that. Mm -hmm. I agree. Like it. That, not bad at that's all. That's good job, aha. Uh -huh. Well, I stand corrected. <laughs> They can do it. <laughs> Who can do it? Next one is super excited about the bubbly bounce. Bubbly bounce is the caffeinated kind. I am kind. so interested in this one right I here. Know, me too. I don't know what to expect at all because it says sparkling water, murder your thirst. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that. Yeah. They had to be metal fans. Yeah, I love the marketing with that yeah. one. It, it's very intriguing. Do you go first? I hear Jose going, da -da. Yeah. Da -da. Da -da. Yeah. Tastes like a bubbly. That aftertaste on that is not very good. This one? Yes. But I didn't like the bubbly bounces anyway. I'd pass on that. It does have a woo on the top. <laughs> you gotta love bubbly. Put a little message for you. Okay, so this, it's not bad. It does have more of an aftertaste than bubblies usually do. Yeah. But for the caffeine, with Bubbly Bounce, I'm willing to drink like the grapefruit flavor and the orange one, the blood orange cherry, which are not my favorite because of the caffeine. So I'll drink that in the morning and I've gotten to where I really like it. That one does have a little bit of an aftertaste to it, but it's got like a yeah, bubble gum. Yeah, it's still gum. not bad. I'm going to say I'd pass, but it's not bad. Yeah. I'd say this is all right because for what it is, it's got a little bit of aftertaste. I'd reach for something else over it, but I wouldn't completely pass on it. Plus, it's got caffeine, which who doesn't love caffeine when you are a mom well, of that's four? Bubbly, sparkling water, white peach, ginger, bubbly. I don't yeah, like that ginger. Ginger scares me. When I was pregnant with the triplets, I had such bad morning sickness that I took like the ginger mints mm. and ginger candies and stuff to try and settle my stomach. So yeah. ginger just, oh, it just reminds me of being sick at my stomach, so. Yeah. Ooh, but I smell peach. I don't smell ginger. Yeah, I couldn't smell much in that anyway. It's not very strong. It's not as, yeah, it's not as strong as bubbly. Scents usually are. Yeah. Message on top says, hey ya. Okay, try it again. So I don't taste ginger, I just taste a little bit of spice to it. Yes, the second drink I did. Yes. First drink, I just tasted peach. Second drink, I tasted the spice from the ginger. Yeah. But it wasn't like overpoweringly ginger that made me not like it. I, I think I like that. I think I'm gonna go with like it. I would drink that. Yeah, you know, it's not gonna be my all time favorite, but right. that's good. We are making our way down here, people. <laughs> Hang tight. We got one more. I am so excited Four. about this one. This one sounds Ooh, so good. Coconut, pineapple, bubbly, and ayo. Ayo. <laughs> ayo. That's kind of cool. Do you always open with your thumb? Yes. Really? Yeah. Hang on. That's so weird. Well, what did you... your pointer? These two. Yeah. Two? Okay. I yeah. mean, I don't have to use two, but I just hold it. <laughs> no. How do you open cans? You got you like the skinniest thumb? little fingers ever. She's like, I use these two. I'm like, whoa, hold on. That's a problem because there's no way I can get two fingers around that little tab. She. Okay, maybe you can't. Yeah, no. How many videos have we done that I, don't know. I haven't noticed? How do y'all open yeah. your cans? This smells so good. Are we corner finger people? Are we the double finger? Or are we thumbs? Come on, thumbs. <laughs> <laughs> Back thumbs me up, up here. This smells like you're at the beach. Let me smell it again. Mm -mm. Okay. 
Yeah, it that's smells not very like strong summer. to me. I know you're pumped up about this one. <sighs> Let me taste it again. <laughs> I'm on the verge of too. <laughs> <laughs> I know what she's going to say. Love it. I, I think I might it. say love it. I was on the verge, like to love. It's going to be a low love for me. Right. It's not like a whoa, slap your mama kind of love, <laughs> but. You better not slap my mama. No, a little bit. <laughs> or your mama. True. My mama would slap me back. <laughs> That's no lie. Shout out to my mom. Love you, mom. But yeah, this, I would say love it. And like like Justin said, it's not a super high, like my all-time favorite love it, but it's definitely in the love it category. Yeah. The grand finale, everybody. Liquid death. <laughs> that's what I, I mean, just look at the can, that's what you see. When well, you see finished. that can, you... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the marketing, <laughs> like... Looking at... <laughs> 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 All right. so oh, yeah, seeing this, I would not normally buy it because I would not go for this marketing. I'm more of... Kind of <laughs> this is more my speed. This is more my style. This I like this calls to me just because I used to listen to a lot of heavy music and, and play a lot of heavy music. Yeah, I used to be in a heavy metal yeah. band back in the day. Rock on people. This is from the Austrian Alps. Something really cool about this, five cents from every can sold is donated to help clean up plastic garbage in oceans. Hashtag death to plastic. They're all about killing. This infinitely recyclable can of stone cold sparkling water came stone straight gold. from the Alps to murder your thirst. And then it has this whole long story about how it murders your thirst. The ingredients are mountain water and CO2. <laughs> how it, how it yes. murders your thirst. Hold on. Murdering process begins with liquid death formulating a rope of veins that will wrap around your thirst head and strangle it. Ooh, we're getting dark here. Yeah. Of its own head imploding. <laughs> <laughs> Which is exactly what happens. That comes it in your Once your thirst <laughs> <laughs> it keeps going. And once that happens. <laughs> I feel like I should anoint my house <laughs> with oil right now and pray before we keep going. But it's alright. Jesus got me. At this point. Drink a second sip of liquid death. Ingredients? Mountain water and CO2. Does all that. It's kind of funny. Wow. Yeah. They're going all out yeah. with this uh, death. I guess so there's no flavor. There's no flavor. Uh oh. So I'm thinking like a Topo Chico taste. Yeah. That's yeah. Which Topo Chico. It's good. If y'all don't know, that's what's up, people. Okay, see? Topo Chico. Two fingers. Yeah, I can't do that. No. <laughs> no scent. No scent. Am I going first? You go for it. I'm not drinking liquid death first. And it is a big <laughs> can, people. It's got some weight to it. All right, hold on. I literally tasted nothing after all that. <laughs> well, it's not supposed to taste like anything. I know, but. Like Topo Chico does taste like something. If you've tried Topo Chico, in comparison to Topo Chico, this seems more like a sweeter, softer water with carbonation. Not right. not as carbonated, but the flavor of the water is more like a soft, sweet water. All right. We're it's about to sweet. make a guest appearance of somebody. My good friend. <laughs> My personal favorite. Mine too. <laughs> Not even close. Doesn't hold a candle. None of it does. None of this holds a candle to that. So true. That is such a tight carbonation. Like, just so good. Yes. Yeah, we both yeah. really love the carbonation level in Topo Chico. If you like less of a carbonation and slightly yeah. sweeter taste, then yeah. this might be. I mean, here's that's the thing. This okay. is, this isn't bad at all this is good i would easily say i like it but knowing that i have had topo chico that is amazing that's where it's at people <laughs> I can't get it. hide hide 
<laughs> this is where it's at. Yeah, I'd say I like this. We'll go with the light. Yeah. Coming in last <sighs> place. This is going to be my lineup from the worst to the best of these. This is my order. Okay. Well, if you're curious. Yeah. This was good. <laughs> yes, that was really good. That was good. So if you're looking to try something. So we hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give us a like and subscribe for more content. We've got a lot of other videos like this. Also. Yes. Our next video in this series is going to be testing polar water. Which polar. Which... Polar could actually compete yeah. with this, I feel like. Polar Lime beat our at the time favorite yeah. of Lime Bubbly. Yeah. So yeah, it's gonna yeah. be a good one. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.